really high price to pay for water. You follow Uncle Gadget to the reservoir. I'll come as soon as possible. Nothing like a day at the reservoir to cool things off. <laughs> Gadget, you can't stop me. I'll keep diverting Metro City's water and I'll sell it back to all those thirsty people. Boulder, Gadget's coming. I'm ready, Dr. Claw. <laughs> Our visitor is approaching the reservoir. Here he comes. Come see here. To the surface, my little mad munchkins. We have work to do. Wowzers. I should have installed gadget air conditioning. Load her up, boys. Gadget won't survive. Kirk Boulder's catapult. <laughs> Gadget is on his way. Boulder, are you ready? Yes, Dr. Claw, we're ready. Right, my short little sidekicks? We are ready. Ready we are. Mm. Welcome to Metro City Dam. Watch for falling rocks. That's right, Gadget. Watch for falling rocks. <laughs> Gadget is on the dam. <laughs> I think I'll check the water level in the reservoir. Why, the reservoir's bone dry. Fire! Wowzers! That sign wasn't kidding about falling rocks. Fire too! Faster! Faster! <laughs> shelter in the reservoir. Hey, buddy, this is no time to sell ice cream. Gadget is heading for the ladder. You two go after him. Go get Gadget. Gadget, go get. I have time for one more shot. This was no time to sell ice cream. Whoa. Oh. Ice water. Get your ice water. Fifty dollars a glass. I'll take some. Me first. Out of my way. Only Dr. Claw would sell water to thirsty people. I'll fix them. Free water! Free water here! Yippee! Okay! Oh. Hey, what's going on? Duh, there's free water over there! I'd better go to the reservoir and check on Uncle. <sighs> This is hotter than a sauna in the Sahara. <laughs> you should learn to drive more carefully. <laughs> I think you should give up driving and stick to selling ice cream. I'd better investigate further upstream. 
Excellent. Ew, I hate chili peppers. I don't see how Gadget can eat those things. Yes, and eating them will be his downfall. <laughs> <laughs> Wowzers, I'm stuffed. But waste not, what not. Go, go, Gadget, burn helping. We have Splashdown. <laughs> this is going to be a blast. <laughs> Pardon me. Huh. My codex is picking up a new Wi-Fi signal called Gadget's Da Bomb Ha Ha Ha? That's weird. Either someone really likes Uncle Gadget or... <gasps> We've got to find it, Brain. Tracking the source of the signal now. <gasps> the signal is coming from your stomach, Uncle Gadget! Oh. Wowzers, now that is an upset stomach. Maybe I had one too many peppers. Huh? Checking to see if my heartburn is spread. Good thinking, Professor. It could be. Level 11 security alert. Level 11? How bad is that? Considering we only go up to number five, very bad. That pepper in Gadget's stomach is a mad micro disruptor designed to sabotage Gadget into firing his weapons against his will. Great galloping gazelles. We've got to get him out of here before he destroys HQ. No! HQ's security agents will trigger the micro-disruptor if he goes through them! What about the G-Portal? No, 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 Penny! The energy from the G-Portal will set him off for sure! Ah, that massage wasn't so bad. Ow! This is all my fault, Brain. If I hadn't ordered that pizza for Uncle Gadget, this never would have happened. <laughs> but I'll make it up to him. We'll keep him from destroying everything. And himself. And us. Somehow. <laughs> Look out! Thanks, Professor. That was the best checkup I've ever had. I feel fantastic. Uncle Claw picked up a reading on Gadget's micro disruptor. He fired his first weapon. Excellent. At this rate, Gadget will destroy HQ by 6 o'clock. That long? Please, he'll level it within the hour. You dare challenge my prediction? Let's make it interesting. How about we make a bet, Uncle Claw? You have a deal. A deal with defeat. <laughs> For you, I mean, you'll be dealing with defeat when I win. J just so we're clear. This is not good. That micro disruptor seems to activate a weapon whenever Gadget's heart rate increases. So we'll need to do everything we can to keep him calm. Keep him calm. Got it. And whatever you do, don't tell him he's a walking bomb. What's that about a bomb? That sounds like a mission. Time to go, Penny. No, you have to stay because you have a beautiful opportunity to teach me because you like doing that. Teach me about, um, staying calm with relaxation techniques for spies so I can learn how to spy relax. I happen to be an expert on spy relaxing, spy unwinding, and spy loosen upping, Penny. Great! And I know just where to do it. Hmm. We could practice relaxing here in the training room. It can simulate any calm setting we want. An excellent idea, Penny. Why don't we try a little technique I like to call Watashi wa Nyongo ho hanasemasen, which in Japanese means I don't speak Japanese. This is great. Very relaxing. First, we start with the traditional tea ceremony. And then, the ninjas! Oh. Oh. Ah. Nothing helps prepare a body for relaxing better than an invigorating workout. Go, go, Gadget Nunchucks! Yeah. Oh. Oh. Not relaxing. Not relaxing at all. Oh. Oh. <laughs> nice! That's it! Keep going! But I'm a 
on police business. So, I'm going to take a chance. Okay, buddy, pull over. Where's the fire? Your wife having a baby? Color blind? Excuse me, officer, before you write a ticket, I'm on official business looking for Police Chief Octuk. Good day, I'm Octuk, Inuvik Chief of Police. Uh, sorry about this ticket, but I haven't written a ticket in a dog's age. is on these slides. Dr. Elmo Focus, a renowned mad scientist, has devised a secret weapon in his laboratory at the North Pole. Codename Snizuka. It's capable of recreating the force of three billion sneezes. It recently leveled an abandoned town. Rumor has it that the next target will be Metro City. <laughs> This map shows how to get to the mad scientist lab. X marks the spot. I'm on my way. But, but, wait. There's another message for you. Really? What's it say? It says, good luck from Chief Quimby. P.S. This message will self-destruct. I've always wanted a heated pool. Gadgets coming your way, Trapper. Yeah, Penny. Go, go, Gadget G-Portal! 
Come to Papa. Come on. Honey, he can't use the cheap portal. All of his weapons will activate. I know. I'm counting on it. I don't understand. Professor, use these coordinates to redirect the portal. Yes! He's going critical! Wait, there's an energy surge right outside. <laughs> Must be HQ blowing up. I gotta check this out. Nope, it's us. Good job, Brain. Wowzers. All that standing around posing for sculptures sure did make me hungry. Who could go for a pizza? A pizza? Sure. But this time, no hot chilies. Gadget was supposed to be the one destroyed. What happened? Beats me, but he blew something up in less than an hour. <laughs> Enjoy your litter box duty. Gadget. figured out Dr. Claw's latest plan. That's what they all say. I guess that's why Uncle Claw built this, the mad laser boosted brain probe, the last word in info retrieval. Just try to relax your cortex, okay? Good. Let the brain probing begin. Uh, uh, it was all my fault. Uh, I'm sorry. Bam, and that's how you do it, folks. <laughs> to the best motivational retreat ever, I... Uh, left the probe running. Ah, he'll mostly be fine. Most of you know me as Mad's top talent, Talent. Those of you who don't know me, I'll have you brain probe later. Anywho, this year's Mad Employee Conference theme is destroying your enemies and loving it. Before we start, I do have to ask any undercover spies to leave. Give him a hand. He's only doing his job. Now, the moment you've been waiting for. You loved him when he drained the world's oceans. You hated him when he stole the world's oxygen. Bad guys want to be him. HQ wants to lock him away. Our evil special guest, Dr. Claw! Yeah! <laughs> Thank you. And silence. Even the most incompetent of you will become much better mad agents during the next few hours. Or else... Is he evil or what? Let's give him a hand! Okay, anyone here from Evilvania? Hmm. Oh, hello, dearie. Would you kindly name all the flowers you have and then immediately repeat them? My memory isn't what it used to be. Uh, well, sure. We have... Oh, man forever! She know I wasn't a real flower girl. Oh. I can't believe I didn't see she was a mad simulation either, Brain. This whole disguise training was a complete bust. Don't be so hard on yourself, Penny. Oh. It's not easy pulling off the perfect disguise. It takes more than just a holographic projection. Chief Quimby, you're here to buy flowers too? Hi, Uncle Gadget. Ah, Penny, it's good to see you've got a part-time job. It builds character and earns a little extra spending money. Inspector Gadget, I'm glad you're here. I've got a new mission for you. HQ has detected the largest gathering of MAD agents ever at a nearby convention center. Your mission is to find out what MAD is up to and stop it. And this time, since I'm reading the mission to you myself, this message will not self-destruct. We're on it, Chief. Sweet. This is the perfect training mission to practice my disguise techniques. Great idea, Penny. You'd better get going. Resume simulation. Ah! Forever! Earthquake damage. I'd better clear the road. When the going gets tough, the tough 
get a van. Ah. Go, go, gadget binoculars. Just as I suspected, I'm in a jungle. Follow me, gadget. What? Follow me, gadget. Follow me, gadget. Wowzers, what luck. This bird must belong to one of the explorers. After you, Polly. Simba, Bula, Bula. So, you won't talk. Well, I'm warning you, this is police business. Wow. Well, that does it. This jungle needs a little law and order. Go, go, gadget weapons! Alligators are a protected species. You're under arrest. Go, go, gadget cups! <laughs> around here. Quicksand has no basement. <laughs> Gadget finished. <laughs> Wait, I have a better idea. Gadget will help us with our plan. Bring him to me.
What's up, evil bros? Looking bad. Hey! Aren't you, Mustache McGee? Didn't we once extinguish the Earth's core together? Uh-huh. That was a hot day. Good times. Good times. Put her there. Um, hi, everyone, and welcome to our anger management seminar. Uh, let me begin by saying I uh, used to be mad. Really, really mad. mad. That is a mad agent, and he must be training everyone else in here. Go, go, gadget handcuffs. <laughs> So far, so good. But hollow disguise fooling mad henchman is always a cinch. Question is, will it work on... Latecomer, huh? I like that. It shows zero respect for authority. Now, time to review everything we've learned so far. <laughs> Come on, let me hear your inner badness. Growl it out loud. Yeah. Louder! Yeah. Louder! Yeah. I said louder. <gasps> People, listen to me! You don't have to give in to mad! Never! Huh? Okay, commence the trust exercise! Ha! <clears throat> <laughs> <laughs> Perfect! Mad agents don't trust anyone! Now, what's next? Ah, first, Embrace your inner evil. Then we break for lunch. Yeah! Oh yeah! In the afternoon, we split into groups and discuss Mad's evil plans for the upcoming year. Mad's evil plans. Are you trying to sneak a peek at my notes? Ha! Impressive. Very sneaky. You've got the making of a great henchman. Okay, chanting time. Evil, 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 evil. evil. I can't believe this is working. I can just keep my cover. Uh, right. Evil! Uh, I mean, evil. Evil! Evil is what happens when you give in to mad. Instead, you should always offer up a helping hand. <laughs> oh, I thought I had that disconnected. Okay, how about the other hand? <laughs> I know, trusting is hard. Group hug! Yes! Nothing frees you from the mad lifestyle like a sing-along! Time for the student to totally humiliate the teacher. Who's up for a beat down? Ooh, me, me! Not bad. Circuit, Penny. <gasps> okay, how did you see through my hollow disguise? I didn't, but I'd know your moves anywhere. Hey, why don't you stick around for the Get Her Seminar starting now? Get her! Huh? <laughs> ah, what part of Get Her didn't you fools understand? I could really use some backup right now. Hey, calm down, everyone. Don't give in to mad. Hey! Ow! Not the gadget face. I just moisturized. <laughs> 